September was amazing. October was short lived. A heartbreaking loss last night for the Milwaukee Brewers who came up just short in the wildcard game in Washington. Our Rebecca Clough watched with loyal fans. People were hoping it was just the start of October baseball, but instead they left here disappointed. Earlier tonight, we caught up with one family that thought they had the lucky charm because it was given to them by Christian Yelich. Get out of here! Yeah! Almost all the attention is on the game in this Muskego home. <laughs> The Lobotas and their extended family are huge Brewer fans, including their dog, Yelly. Go we named him Yelly, um, short for Yelich, obviously. Yelly isn't just any dog. You might remember Lola and Libby held up this sign earlier this year, asking Christian Yelich to hit a home run so their dad would buy him a puppy. Not only did he do it, we were there when Yelich gave them the dog. How's you guys a present? Six months later, and even though his namesake is hurt, they believe Yelly is helping the team win. I think just, you know, bringing Yelly and having all the family here is a good enough luck charm. Over at Miller Park, inside Fridays, people are feeling the good vibes in the shadow of the field. We thought, what better place than uh, if we can't be at the wild card? It's not, on, uh, not at home, so let's come here. This is the first time ever in franchise history the Brewers have been to a wild card. I was raised on the Brewers. It's tradition. It's fun. So we're just excited. And they're ready for the playoffs to continue in Milwaukee. I think we got this. <laughs> I do. I think we got this in the bag. I hope we got this, put it that way. <laughs> yeah, and it was a hard loss tonight for everyone, but the Lobota family says they have good news to focus on. They are training their dog, Yelly, to detect when their daughter's blood sugar drops. She has type 1 diabetes. Reporting in Milwaukee, Rebecca Clough, today's TMJ4.